Welcome back to the new series of Making This House a Home. Today is day three of redoing my daughter's nursery. And today I need to cut angled pieces of molding for her bedroom. Yesterday when I finished up, I realized that I did not cut them at an angle and therefore it wouldn't make sense. So this is me doing all of that. I couldn't hire my husband today. He was busy going on a wilderness adventure with our daughter in the tundra. Obviously it was way too cold for me. So I was cutting inside, which I don't know, like a little vacuum will sweep de sweeped and I'll be all good. And of course, when I finished up, my husband came back from the wilderness adventure just in time to watch me finish the project but whatever I made sure that everything was measured properly put some liquid nail glue on took the nail gun and put everything in place oh and like you know when you like paint a room you like write a little note well I decided to do that with the liquid nail glue so on this very last piece of board I wrote Nora with a little heart on it here I am doing it oh my god so cute this part of the project is just more like soothing you just kind of take the wood filler put it over all the nail holes then it dries pretty quickly and then you just sand it up the end so I had to of course vacuum and then this was me caulking it I couldn't figure out this glue gun it just like kept coming out and then I figured it out by the end of course but whatever I caulked up all the things so it was nice and seamless and then I got the little sander and do 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 filled all the sand so it was nice and smooth not the sand the holes whatever and that pretty much wraps up all the DIY aspect of this I am going to hire Rolando to paint her room and then after that it's just design baby 